Three people are feared dead after a migrant boat carrying 50 people faced navigational difficulties off the French coast in the English Channel. Despite the French Navy's rescue efforts, two people remain missing and a third person was found but could not be revived. Deputy Prosecutor at the Judicial Courts of boulogne sur mer confirmed the death, stating that an investigation is ongoing. French maritime authorities conducted four rescue operations on Wednesday with boats and a helicopter to assist nearly 180 people. The UK Home Office also acknowledged the incident. These developments come as Home Office figures reveal that over 2,000 migrants arrived in the UK so far this year after crossing the Channel. While this marks a 32% decrease from the same period in 2023, it represents a 49% increase from the same period in 2022. The Home Office reported over 29,000 migrant arrivals for the entire year in 2023. That is 36% less than the record 45,000 arrivals in 2022. Well, the Home Secretary James Cleverly, currently in the US, has addressed unauthorised migration, emphasising that the UK's goodwill towards migrants is not limitless. Meanwhile, the opposition Labour Party also accused the government of overspending on asylum support. The government partly claims that the UK government is spending, the opposition party should I say, claims the UK government is spending £15 million or over $18.9 million daily to accommodate asylum seekers in hotels. This has resulted in an overspend of £4.3 billion or $5.4 billion in the past year. The developments come after the UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak in January last year pledged to prioritise stopping migrant boats as one of his top five commitments to the electorate. It's now time for the Lords to pass this bill too.